Grant victory to the Orthodox Christians over their adversaries, and by the virtue of thy cross, preserve thy habitation. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, and triumph the Church of the Firstborn. Doth celebrate with gladness, receiving a mother who rejoiceth in her children. For the namesake of wisdom, she gave birth to daughters equal in number to the virtues of theology, and beholdeth them betrothed to the bridegroom. God the Word, with the wise virgins, with her do we rejoice in spirit at the memorial, saying, O faith, hope, and love, ye champions of the Trinity, make us steadfast in faith, hope, and love, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O thou who for our sake was born of a virgin, and didst suffer crucifixion, O good one, and didst fall death by death, and as God dost reveal the resurrection, <coughs> disdain not them which thou hast fashioned with thy hand. Show forth thy love for mankind, O merciful one, accept the fail tokos who gave thee birth, who intercedeth for us, and do thou our Savior, save the despairing people. Deliver us not up utterly for thy holy name's sake, neither disannul thou thy covenant, and cause not thy mercy to depart from us. For Abraham's sake thy beloved, and for Isaac's sake thy servant, and for Israel's thy holy one. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O most holy Trinity, have mercy on us. O Lord, blot on our sins. O Master, pardon our iniquities. O Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for thy name's sake. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in the heavens, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts, as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For thy name is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, and the Holy Spirit, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. O thou who hast lifted up willingly upon the cross, bestow thy mercies upon the new community named after thee, O Christ God. Gladden with thy power the Orthodox Christians, granting them victory over enemies. May they have as thy help the weapon of peace, the invincible trophy. Lord of mercy, 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 Lord have mercy. Now of good all times and at every hour in heaven and on earth art worshiping glorified, O Christ God, who art long suffering, plenteous in mercy, most compassionate, who loveth the righteous and hast mercy on sinners, who calleth all the salvation through the promise of good things to come. Receive, O Lord, our prayers in this hour, and guard our life for thy commandments. Sanctify our souls, make chaste our bodies, correct our thoughts, purify our intentions, and deliver us from every sorrow, evil, and pain. Compass us about with thy holy angels that guarded and guided by their array we may attain to the unity of the faith and the knowledge of thine unapproachable glory. For blessed art thou unto the ages of ages. Amen. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. More honorable than the cherubim, and beyond compare, more glorious than the seraphim, who without corruption gave us birth to God the Word, the very Theotokos, who we magnify. In the name of the Lord, Father, bless. God be gracious to us and bless us and cause our face to shine upon us and have mercy on us. Amen. O oh, Master, Lord Jesus Christ, our God, who art long suffering in the face of our transgressions and who has brought us even into this present hour, where let us hang upon the life giving tree and just make a way into paradise for the wise thief and by death just destroy death. <clears throat> be gracious unto us sinners and then unworthy servants, for we have sinned and committed iniquity and are not worthy to lift up our eyes and that he hold the height of heaven. We have abandoned the way of thy righteousness and have walked in the desires of our hearts. But we beseech thy boundless goodness. Spare us, O Lord, according to the multitude of thy mercy, and save us for thy holy name's sake, for our days are consumed in vanity. Rescue us from the hand of the adversary, and forgive us our sins, and mortify our carnal mind, that putting aside the old man we may be clad with the new, and live for thee our master and benefactor, <clears throat> and that thus by following in thy commandments we may attain to rest everlasting, wherein is the dwelling place of them that rejoice. For thou art indeed the true joy and the gladness of them that love thee, O Christ our God, and unto thee we send of glory, with an unoriginate Father, the most holy and good and life giving Spirit, now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Blessed is our God, our Holy Son, and unto the age of ages. Amen. Come, let us worship God our King. Come, let us worship and fall down before Christ our King God. Come, let us worship and fall down before Christ Himself our King God. Bless the Lord, O my soul, O Lord, my God, thou hast been magnified exceedingly. 
Confession and majesty as thou put on, who coverest thyself with light of the dawn, who stretchest out the heaven as a pure curtain, who supported his chambers in the water, who appointed a palace for his ascent, who walketh upon the wings of the winds, who maketh his angels, spirits, and his ministers a flame of fire, who establisheth the earth in the sureness thereof, it shall not be turned back forever and ever. The abyss, like a garment, is his mantle. Upon the mountains shall the waters stand. At thy rebuke they will flee, at the voice of thy thunder shall they be afraid. The mountains rise up, and the plains sink down unto the place where thou hast established them. Thou appointest a bound that they shall not pass, neither return to cover the earth. He sendeth forth springs in the valleys, between the mountains will the waters run. They shall give drink to all the beasts of the field, the wild asses away to quench their thirst. Beside them will the birds of the heaven lodge, from the midst of the rocks will they give voice. He watereth the mountains from his chambers, the earth shall be satisfied with the fruit of thy works. He causeth the grass to grow for the cattle and green earth for the service of men, to bring forth bread out of the earth, and wine maketh glad the heart of man. To make his face cheerful with oil and breath strengtheneth man's heart. The trees of the plain shall be satisfied. The cedars of Lebanon which thou hast planted, there will the sparrows make their nests. The house of the heron is chief among them. The high mountains are a refuge for the hearts, and so is the rock for the hares. He hath made the moon for seasons, the sun knoweth his going down. Thou appointest the darkness, and there was the night wherein all the beasts to the forest will go abroad, young lions roaring after their prey and seeking their food from God. The sun ariseth, and they are gathered together, and they lay them down in the dance. But man shall go forth unto his work, and to his labor until the evening. How magnified are thy works, O Lord, and wisdom hast thou made them all. The earth is filled with thy creation, so is this great and spacious sea. Therein are things creeping in the world, small living creatures with the great. There go the ships, there this dragon, and thou hast made to play therein. All things wait on thee to give them their food in due season. When thou givest it, then they will gather it. When thou openest thy hand, all things shall be filled with goodness. When thou turnest away thy face, they shall be troubled. Thou wilt take their spirit, and they shall cease, and unto their dust till they return. Thou wilt send forth thy spirit, and they shall be created. And thou shalt renew the face of the earth. Let the glory of the Lord be unto the ages. The Lord rejoice in his works. Who look upon the earth and maketh it tremble, who toucheth the mountains and they smoke. I will sing unto the Lord throughout my life. I will chant to my God for as long as I have my being. May my words be sweet unto him, and I will rejoice in the Lord. O oh, that sinners would cease from the earth, and they that work iniquity, that they should be no more. Bless the Lord, O oh, my soul. The sun knoweth is going down, thou appointest the darkness, and there was the night. How magnified are thy works, O Lord, and wisdom hast thou made them all. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and the ages of ages, amen. Hallelujah, 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 glory to thee, O God. Hallelujah, 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 glory to thee, O God. Hallelujah, 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 glory to thee, O God. In peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Peace from above and the salvation of our souls. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. May the peace of the whole world, the good estate of the Holy Churches of God, and the union of all, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Lord, your soul be temple and for them that with faith, reverence and the fear of God at your hearing. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Lord, 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 Lord Father, His Holiness, Patriarch, Kirill, Pharaoh, and the very most, Reverend Metropolitan, the Lion, First Hierarch for the Russian Church abroad, for the Venerable Priesthood, the Diaconate of Christ, for all the clergy and people, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. The all venerable abbot of this holy monastery, our command right seraphim and all his brethren in Christ, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For his land, his authorities, and armed forces, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Preserved Russian lands, Orthodox people, both in the homeland and in the diaspora.
gospel, and for your salvation, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. That he may deliver his people from enemies, visible and invisible, and confirm in us oneness of mind, brotherly love, and piety. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Holy Monastery for every city and country and the faithful who dwell therein. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For seasonable weather, abundance of the fruits of the earth and peaceful times, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. Sick to suffer in the imprisoned and for your salvation, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. That we may be delivered from all tribulation, wrath, and necessity, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by thy grace. Lord have mercy. Calling to remembrance our most holy, most pure, most blessed, glorious Lady, the Tocos, and ever Virgin Mary, with all the saints, let us commend ourselves and one another in all our lives unto Christ our Lord. To thee, O Lord. Thy 
sight of the holy glory of the immortal heavenly holy blessed Father, O Jesus Christ, having come to the setting of the sun, having beheld the evening light, we praise the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, God. Meet it is for thee at all times to be hymned with reverent voices, O Son of God, giver of life, wherefore the world doth glorify thee. Let us attend peace be unto all, wisdom, the and the the O God, in thy name, save me, and in thy strength do thou judge me. O God, in thy name, save me, and in thy strength do thou judge me. O God, how good to my prayer to hear unto the words of my mouth. O God, in thy name, save me, and in thy strength do thou judge And in thy strength, do thou judge me. Vouchsafe, O Lord, to keep us this evening without sin. Blessed art thou, O Lord, the God of our fathers, and praised and glorified is thy name unto the ages. Amen. Let thy mercy, O Lord, be upon us, according as we have hoped in thee. Blessed art thou, O Lord, teach me thy statutes. Blessed art thou, O Master, give me understanding of thy statutes. Blessed art thou, O Holy One, enlighten me by thy statutes. O Lord, thy mercy endureth forever, disdain not the work of thy hands. To thee is due praise, to thee is due a song, to thee glory is due. To the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Let us complete our evening prayer unto the Lord. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by thy grace. Lord, have mercy. That the whole evening may be perfect, holy, peaceful, and sinless. Let us ask for the Lord. Grant this, O Lord. Lord of peace, a faithful guide, a guardian of our souls and bodies. Let us ask of the Lord. Grant this, O Lord, pardon the remission of our sins and offenses, let us ask of the Lord. Grant this, O Lord, things good and profitable for our souls and peace for the world, let us ask of the Lord. Grant this, O Lord, that we may complete the remaining time of our life in peace and repentance, let us ask of the Lord. Grant this, O Lord, a Christian ending to our life, painless, blameless, peaceful, and a good defense before the great judgment seat of Christ. Let us ask. Grant this, O Lord, calling to remembrance our most holy, most pure, most blessed, glorious Lady Theotokos and ever Virgin Mary with all of the saints. Let us commend ourselves and one another and all our life unto Christ our God. To thee, O Lord, For a good God, our God, and a lover of mankind, and unto thee do we send our glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of the ages. Amen. Peace be unto all, and to thy spirit. Let us bow our heads unto the Lord, to glorified be the dominion of thy kingdom, of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Worship the foot to love his feet, for it is holy. 
rejoice, divine preservation of the faithful, unassailable rampart of Christ of the Lord, whereby we are exalted above the earth. God is our King before the ages. He hath brought salvation in the midst of the earth. Follow ye and in gladness, let us all venerate the life bearing tree, where our blessed touch Christ our deliverer is. Why but now the fourth God, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, from now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. More is its prefiguring the activity. Of the precious cross of Christ, vanquished Amalek, his adversary in the wilderness of Sinai. For when he stretched out his arms, warming the image of the cross, he strengthened the people. And now these events have found their fulfillment in us. Today the cross is elevated and the demons flee. Today, all creation is free from corruption. Forgiveness that shone forth upon us because of the cross. Wherefore, rejoicing, we all know them before his saying. Glory to thee, O Lord, for thy works are magnified. Now let us thou thy servant depart in peace, O Master, according to thy word. From an eyes have seen thy salvation, which thou hast prepared for the face of all peoples, a light of revelation for the Gentiles, and the glory of thy people Israel. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever and in the of ages. Amen. O most holy Trinity, have mercy on us, O Lord, blot out our sins. O Master, pardon our iniquity, is a holy one, visit and heal our infirmities for thy name's sake. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever and the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in the heavens, hallowed be thy name. For thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. <coughs> give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. Before us, and the Orthodox here and everywhere lay to rest. 
Again, we pray for mercy, life, peace, health, salvation, visitation, pardon, and remission of the sins of the servants of God, the brethren of the same monastery. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Again, we pray for them that bring offerings and do good works in this holy and all venerable temple, for them that minister in them that chant, and for all the people here present. Way to be great and above in mercy. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. More than all others, we have sinned against thee and we have transgressed, O Master. And if we have not acquired repentance instead of repentance, accept our offering. And having set thyself to mercy as thou art almighty, free thy servants from the coronavirus, groaning in vain, we pray thee quickly, heart, and have mercy. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Look down, O Master, who loves mankind, upon the sacrificial that labors by medical workers. And send them steadfast health, strength and fortitude and spirit, wisdom to accomplish their work for the good of our people, and bring about through them the healing of thy suffering servants. We earnestly pray thee quickly hearken and have mercy. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Again we pray to our Lord and Savior that he might preserve the Orthodox Church throughout the world in unity and piety, and grant unto Peace and tranquility, love and accord. Let us all say, O Lord, mark and have mercy. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Again, we pray that He will bless the building of our new church and that its foundation may be laid successfully to the glory of His name and that it may be continued speedily without hindrance unto its completion by the power and operation and grace of the Most Holy Spirit. Let us all say, O Lord, Hearken and have mercy. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Lord, merciful God art thou and the lover of mankind, and unto thee we send our glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto the ages of our region. Amen. Wisdom. Bless Christ our God, always now and ever, and unto the ages of the ages. Amen. Establish, O God, the holy Orthodox faith of Orthodox Christians unto the ages of the ages. O most holy Theotokos, save us. O our honorable and the cherubim, and be not the fair, more glorious than the seraphim. Who without corruption gave us birth to God the Word, the very day of the Lord, be magnified. Glory to thee, O Christ, God our hope, glory to thee. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, Lord, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Father, we Christ, our true God, through the intercessions of His most pure love, through the power of the precious and life-giving cross, through the holy intercessions of the holy glorious and all praised apostles of our fathers among the saints, Nicholas the Wonder Worker, Archbishop of Myra, and Lycia, the holy great martyr and healer Pontelaine, of our holy father Eumenes, Bishop of Gortina, the Wonder Worker, and of our holy father Hilarion, Monk of uh, Optina Hermitage, whose memory we celebrate, and of the holy and righteous ancestors of God, you will and now, and of all the saints, have mercy on us and save us. Praise God and the Lord of mankind. Amen. Amen. Our great Lord and Father, give you a holy patriarch, and master, and our Russia, our Lord, the very most reverend, the Lord, Metropolitan, of Eastern America, and New York. The first hierarch of the Russian Church of God, the all venerable abbot of this holy monastery, Archimedes, the brethren of this holy monastery, and all Orthodox Christians, preserve, O Lord, for many years.